Welcome to my next video. Today I have another camera system in, AOIT. It's a 1080p security camera solar panel. It's got the uh, AI human detection, night vision, and cloud storage with a subscription to, or take a screenshot. Uh, it's Wi-Fi, some of the features on this one. It's like I said, AI human detection, notification to your smartphone, night vision, two-way talk, and uh, 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi. They have several different camera systems. We have this one. So we're going to open it up and see what's inside. got the user's manual this is an R6 security camera you got the QR code which you can use to download the app I just uh, did a video about their doorbell camera so I'll be able to use the same app and like always they got very detailed instructions I owe it app you can get from your Google Store or Apple Store depending where you get your apps step-by-step -step instructions very very straightforward very easy setup first of all there is the solar panel that'll keep it charged 24 7 they work very well long cord plug it right in mount with the swivel get any angle you need the camera itself very heavy should be good quality you need night vision camera lens Charging port. This well, this is where we'll plug into the solar panel. Speaker for your two-way talk. Power button and connect. What else you got? Oh, your cable to do the charging. You should pre-charge the battery as much as you can. Well, 100%. And then hook on the solar panel. It works much better that way. Another mount bracket. One is for the camera itself and one is for the solar panel. I'll show you how that works. Anything else? That's it. That's it. That's all we need. So we'll get it hooked to the app. Okay, we'll get the camera hooked to the app. I already have the app downloaded because I have the camera, the doorbell camera hooked to it. It's the same app. Just go to your Google Play or Apple Play and AWIT app or scan the QR code. But anyway, you just click add device. And we gotta make sure the power is on. So you hold the power button for three seconds. Power on. Entering pairing mode. Now you gotta select the right camera. It's the battery. Entering pairing mode. Yeah, it talks right to you. Entering pairing mode. Okay, so you gotta select the right camera. This is the battery camera. And you gotta allow the app to use your information. Basically, you can have it only when you're using the camera. So that's what I like to do. And select the camera, R6. Entering pairing mode. If you did that, then we gotta hold the 
setup button, which is to the right of the power button, for eight seconds. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Next. Entering pairing mode. Searching. Picks up the, your Wi Fi. My password's already in, so it should right connect. Confirm. Entering pairing mode. To obtain distribution network information and wait for Wi Fi connection. Wi Fi, but it's Wi Fi, but you know computer voices. Successful. Waiting for device registration. Yes. Just really straightforward, easy setup. Confirm. Device registration successful. Now, you don't want your doorbell camera, obviously, so we got to go to the one we just set up, the solar. Voila! Looking at the ceiling. Well, now she's looking at the camera. I mean, my phone. So we'll get it mounted and uh, take it from there. I'll show you how it works from there. Now you're looking at my mug. If you're wondering why I got no shirt, it's like 40 degrees here in BC. So it's a little hot, especially in the office. I'll get it mounted, hooked up, and uh, we'll show you how it looks on the app from there. Okay, first we're gonna get the um, solar panel mounted. Okay, solar panels mounted on that tree. I got like six systems around my house. So I'm gonna put this one out where I know there's animals, raccoons and bears coming through here. So I'm gonna focus the camera and see if I can get some good footage of them. You just gotta make sure your panel is catching some sunlight. I've had them working all winter with these panels and it worked fine. So we'll see. If not, I might have to move the panel slightly over to get more sunlight. Now I'll hook up the uh, mount the camera itself. Okay, I got the mount for the camera mount on the where I want it positioned. Now I just screw on the camera and plug her into the solar panel. Just like that. Okay, yeah, so you got the solar panel mounted. Tie the wires out of the way is always nice. Down and into the camera itself. And now she's charging. I got it kind of going down to the side of the building. If there's any uh, intruders that way or animals, be interesting to catch something. But let's see how it's gonna look on the app. And also, depending on how far your Wi-Fi reaches, right? So we'll go back into the house there and see if we can pick it up. Okay, back in the house and we're a good uh, 80 feet from the camera itself. And she's picking up and she's live. Once again, you can take a. Oh, I'm getting notifications because, I, like I say, I got uh, other cameras that are going off from different motion. But you can take a snapshot. You can switch the the view. Nice clear picture. You got the record. You got turn on the light if you want. It's got the camera charge. Right now she's at about 70, so it's got to catch some sun there, it'll be charged up in no time. Okay, yeah, for playbacking video, or to see what you recorded from the motions, 
Let's hit the playback upper right, hit the camera, and it has the different events are listed. And also, uh, you can change the name because I see I got this as front door. But you can edit it easy and change the name to whatever you want. Make sure the date's correct, time's correct. You can set that in the app. So it's a very good camera. Cheap, too. I think it's, uh, well, not cheap, but qu quite reasonably priced. Usually under $100. So if you think it's something you could use, I'm going to have links in the description. I'll also have the link to the doorbell camera. which is this one my front door also has a chime you can stick in your house on any USB port thanks for watching Be sure to subscribe like follow all that good stuff really helps me out thanks a lot and we'll catch you on the next video